this time, okay, I'm gonna start to set up an overhead sweep when my partner tries to put a lot of pressure down. So as he does, I keep my knee tight so he can't really drop all his weight. I'm gonna take the sleeve. All I'm gonna do is circle it around a little bit, right? It doesn't matter, even if he maintains his grip, I'm gonna be able to shoot my hand through and feed a cup grip there. I control this so he can't pulse when I set up my sweep. This hand goes in a collar. I'm gonna put this foot on the mat, open my knee, and when I open my knee, I'm gonna place my outside foot nice and tight on the ribs here, okay? Notice how my toes are pointing to the outside. So once I have the control here, I'm gonna pull my partner down, load him over on top of me. I'm going to do a roll and make my partner do a forward roll over his shoulder, right? So it's not a big extending sweep. I say balled up, launch a little bit, roll over my shoulder, and I come up and I'm ready to pass the guard, or again, go back to our football. So we're here, this time my partner has the same control, right? And as he tries to compress me, I make sure I keep my knee facing up, right? I keep extending. I'm gonna grab the cuff grip, circle, shoot my hand through as deep as possible, and trade it off so I can get a nice good grip here, right? Once I get that grip, this hand comes in the collar, my foot goes in the mat, I open my knee to create space for my hook to come in on the same side, right? Not across. So now I have a lot of leverage to control this side of his body, right? I have his arm, his leg, and his hip control. So I pull him down to load him on top of me, and I'm making him do a forward roll over this shoulder, right? I'm not extending, I'm keeping him tight, and I just roll with him. Come up, keep my grip so I can go down to attack the foot or pass the guard. 